It is graduation season, of course, and all this week, KCAL News reporter Jasmine Shaw has a sky high view of some of the colleges and universities in the greater LA area. And Pat, tonight he's over Occidental College with our look at this at one of the oldest colleges on the West Coast. We'll take a look at this campus in Eagle Rock. It's Occidental College, the home of the Tigers. They say they're LA's first and only liberal arts college, one of the oldest colleges on the West Coast, founded in 1887. This is not where Occidental was always located, though. It was actually founded in Boyle Heights by a group of clergymen and missionaries from the Presbyterian Church. That original building burned down in 1896. They bounced around a few other locations before settling on this gorgeous 120-acre campus in 1912. A lot of the buildings designed by renowned local architects Myron Hunt. We've looked at a lot of his work in the past. That includes the Rose Bowl, the Huntington Estate, and Caltech. He designed 19 different buildings here, and all of them are still in use today. Here on the west end of the campus, one of the oldest sports fields in Los Angeles. This is Patterson Field, opened in 1916. Occidental, also one of the founders of intercollegiate sports in Southern California, and as such, they have the oldest rivalry in the region. That's with Pomona College, when that kicked off in 1895, when they beat Pomona 16 to nothing in football. When it comes to academic 45 different programs to major and minor in here at Occidental. Some of their strengths include chemistry, biology, political science, and economics. Some of the major achievements from Oxy alumni include the uh, helping to develop the computer disk drive, as well as pioneering the concept of audio and video streaming. They also helped uh, make EKG machines a lot more widely in use in the field of medicine, and they even developed a program to help protect planet Earth from asteroids. Former President Barack Obama spent a couple of years here at Occidental before transferring to Columbia University. Hollywood A-listers Luke Wilson and Ben Affleck also spent a couple of years here. And speaking of Hollywood, of course, such a gorgeous campus has been in a lot of different movies and television shows, including Star Trek III, uh, Jurassic Park III, HBO's Rome, uh, Criminal Minds, Law and Order Los Angeles, so many more. The college says they are small but mighty, and they've been helping prepare students for the real world for more than 135 years. A big congratulations to all of the Tigers graduating this year. Taking a look at this from SkyCal, I'm Desmond Shaw. And if you'd like Desmond to take a look at something interesting in your neighborhood, just write us at look at this at cbs.com.